Hi, I'm Angela. And it's been a while. <laughs> you should take a shot for every time I say that. Or say I'm going to film a video and I don't. <sighs> Wait, I'm not supposed to take these shots. You are. This video is not going the way I thought it was gonna go. We're on a quarantine. Hi. <laughs> it is a crazy time right now. And it's not just here, it's all over the world. We're all going through the same thing. Um, it's very surreal. You know, we're all staying home to stay safe. You better be staying home. Stay home. So I have a lot of time on my hands and I thought this is the perfect time to do an update video. And I also wanted to do the Tarkuna coffee, the really popular um, like 400 stirring coffee that's been going around. I've been wanting to do that for a while and <laughs> I have the coffee here that I've had for a long time. Um, so I want to make it. I want to try it and see what the fuss is about. I asked you guys on Instagram for some questions. So I'm going to be making this and catching up with you guys. So let's try this out. So this Tarkona coffee got popular within the past couple of months because it resembles Tarkona, which is a Korean candy, which is made from sugar and baking soda. And when you stir it, it has this caram light caramel color and um, it's, it's quite hard. I've never had it. I've seen um, it on shows, Korean shows all the time. I actually wanted to, I actually bought the kit on eBay and it couldn't get delivered to me because of everything that's going on. But I want to make that one time. I don't think I ever tried it. So it's equal parts instant coffee, sugar, and water. I'm going to take two spoons of the instant coffee, two spoons of sugar. Then you're supposed to take two spoons of warm water. And then stir. Well, oh, this is supposed to be like 400 stirring coffee. I don't have a blender, or any, I don't have a hand mixer or anything like that. Question, what have you been binge watching lately? So I've been obsessed with Shit's Creek. The finale just ended um, a couple days ago and uh, the first five seasons is on Netflix. I binge watched that within, I think, two, three weeks. Such a funny show. I want to rewatch it. It was, it's, it's a really good show if you haven't seen it. So funny and, you know, a lot of character development and it's a really, really good show. The color is changing already. What have you been doing to keep yourself occupied during this pandemic? Love you. Love you too. Um, I have been, again, I'm late to the game. I just started reading Harry Potter. If you're a Harry Potter fan, don't get mad. Um, so I started reading the books last week. <laughs> I'm on book four. Um, this is a monster of a book, um, but I finally started Harry Potter and I'm enjoying it. So what I've been doing is I read the first book and then um, I watched the movie. So I watched, I read the first book, watched the first movie, read the second book, watched the second movie, and now I'm on the fourth book and I haven't been getting too much sleep because I'm staying home <laughs> reading it like crazy. Have you been personally affected by COVID-19? I have not, thankfully. Um, the only thing is that I'm working from home. And with that, I'm very fortunate that I can work from home, especially with all these people being laid off. No one person has, that I know, um, has had it and, you know, very fortunate that we're, everyone's okay. What is your profession and are you doing what you had hoped for in your career? I work for a website and internet marketing company. Um, I do, I'm account manager, project manager, accountant. <laughs> It's a very small company, so yeah, I do a lot of stuff there. Um, is it what I hope for in my career? I mean, there's days where, yeah, job is okay. Is it what I want to do for the long run? I'm still 
figuring that out. It pays the bills. I, it's like already creamy, but I want this to be like thick. Thick with two C's. Imino, uh, Songjungi, or Pak Sojun. I think right now, uh, uh, Pak Sojun. I don't have a question, I just want to say I miss you. Please stay safe, take care. Thank you, Piggy Nini. Miss you. You stay safe. You stay safe. <laughs> you say, oh my, you stay safe. Wow. Wow. There's a bunch of repeated questions like this about mukbangs and stuff like that. Um, I can't eat. <laughs> that way, let me rephrase that. Um, I can't eat a lot of things right now because um, I have gallstones. So I did an update a couple months ago on my Instagram. Last year in November, I went to the ER with extreme pain um, in my stomach and all around my back. It was just like all around my upper, air, my upper area. I have a really high pain tolerance and the fact that I felt that I needed to go to the ER for this really, really freaked me out. Um, went around like two o'clock in the morning. It was extremely painful and they um, ran a lot of te tests, gave me like tons of morphine. Um, it turns out I have gallstones and I need to get my gallbladder removed. Uh, long story short, I had in problems with my insurance. And then on top of that, my mom ruptured um, part of her lower spine and so I told her she needed to get her surgery first and so on top of that my grandma was sick um, beginning of this year so yeah my mom got surgery she's still recovering and then I had more problems with my insurance so then I finally got my surgery date set for April 10th and with everything that's been going on, it got canceled, which completely understand. I'm not gonna lie and say I, I haven't been frustrated with this whole, like, <laughs> November of last year, and I still haven't gotten surgery. So the past couple months have been extremely frustrating and, and, and stressful, because on top of putting my health on pause, taking care of my mom, taking care of my grandma, and then working full time, it was, I wanted to explode. <laughs> um, thankfully, my mom is getting better, my grandma is better, and then now I just have to wait it out to see when, I don't know when, I don't know when I'll have surgery. Um, for the meantime, I have to be extremely careful of what I eat um, to avoid all fats, like all fatty foods. So even healthy fats like avocado, egg yolks, nuts, um, I can't have that. So I can't eat much. It's been really sad. Um, let me let me try and whisk. Do you have any recommended Korean dramas to watch on Netflix? Uh, I haven't been really watching Korean dramas. Um, I watch a lot of variety shows. I love watching I Live Alone, Pek Jo Won's Food Alley, Let's Eat Together. What else is there? Um, Fun Strand, where this got popular from that show. Oh, back to the food, what foods I've been craving lately. Everything. <laughs> I've been craving everything. Uh, so I did make, a, I made a list of things I want to eat after my surgery and cream barbecue, sushi fried chicken, hot Cheetos, a good <laughs> sandwich, ramen, uh, jajangmyeon, chocolate. I've been, uh, I really want chocolate for some reason. And I keep adding on to this list anytime I want to eat something. Soon, I don't know when. Oh my gosh. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. It's pretty thick. Look at that. I got some fat-free milk. This is the first time I'm having dairy in like half a year. All right, let's try this. It 
Is there enough? Do I have to make more? I think I need to make more. No! Be right back. This one had turned out nice. It's overflowing. Hmm. It's a little bitter, but I thought it was gonna be a little sweeter than this, but it's pretty good. How am I supposed to drink this? Oh no. Oh no. <laughs> hmm. have a straw it's a lot better than i thought it was going to be i've seen mixed reactions on this where people are like oh my gosh it's so good and the other people are like oh it's bitter i think it's in between it's not bad but it's it's not like wow <laughs> do you know what else i have soju i got the blueberry kind shall we it kind of smells like dynatap do you guys know that cough medicine where it's like grape, but this is blueberry, but it smells like diner top. Let's try it. Kumbe. I was at the Korean market last week and um, I was looking for the pineapple soju but they didn't have it. Um, they weren't, the one I went to only had a very limited amount but blueberry was like gone. This was like one of the few that was left so I assumed it was very popular so I got the blueberry one. I kind of want to get the other flavors. I think there was four different flavored ones there like strawberry, grapefruit, peach. Maybe I'll do a sequel to the soju video. <laughs> Why not? <sighs> Why not add it to this? Booze it up. Do you like Japagori? Have you seen Parasite? And what do you think? I love you. Love you. I love Japagori. Um, I've seen Parasite, great movie. I was watching it with my grandmother and my mom and my aunt stopped by too when we were watching it. And um, cause we rented it from home. Uh, it came to the scene where, this is not a spoiler or anything, but it came to the scene where they're on the couch and filling each other up. At first I thought, okay, it's fine. I don't need to fast forward because it's probably gonna, you know, be like a little bloop bloop and then, you know, continue. But then it went on for a while and I was like, oh my gosh, where's the controller? Where's the controller? Fast forward! <laughs> it was awkward. Uh, it was awkward. <laughs> Especially my grandma's like, can you do cooking videos or mukbangs? There's a lot of these questions. I, I want to. I want to do cooking videos. Look, I I know I have been gone, but I make constant lists of things I want to do. That's just one list. Um, I have so much more of things I see and I keep adding to my list. I'm gonna make this and just now is I can because I can't eat it. <laughs> it's really sad the things I eat on a day-to-day -day basis. One of the things is sweet potatoes. Every day I eat sweet potatoes and thankfully I'm not sick of it because um, I, I love this. <laughs> Again, I'm very limited of what I can eat. Um, mm. I did do a roasting, oh, this is perfect. I did do a roasting sweet potato video when I did that Vicky video, but I might just do one for my channel too. Focus. Mm. Sweet potato mukbang. <laughs> I don't know why I just did that. Mm. 
There's a lot more questions though. A lot of you guys asking how I've been and how are you. Uh, I'm sorry for, you know, if I've worried you guys again since my last update. And if you want to see what I've been up to from the past 2000 to 2017 to 2018 um, slash 2019, that's my last video. Is it here or link it somewhere? Thank you for your questions on Instagram. You can follow me at Angela Minji Kim. Probably the only semi thing that I have been updating ish. I'll try to update more. It's good to catch up with you guys. I'm excited. There's other things I want to do. By the way, I'm quarantined with my family. I come to my apartment very few times. I mean, it's not finished, but for the most part, I'm, I'm with my family to take care of them. And also, you know, I don't think anyone wants to be alone during this time. Oh my gosh, I'm like almost, oh. In the meantime, I hope you guys are doing well as always. Stay safe. Stay at home. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. Ooh.